Ave TV rounding up here down here at Fulham. Uh, Arsenal winning the game by five goals to one. What's been the difference with last year's Arsenal and this year's Arsenal? You, you actually see, like even when we were 5-1 up, Unai Emery is still on that line. He's screaming at the players saying, I want you doing this, I want you doing that. See, when we, if we were, what, were winning 5-1, maybe Russell Wenger, I don't think that would be seeing that. He's trying to get every little last bit out of these players, which is great from him. And, and you know, there's certain players that he is squeezing out of them. Yeah. Iwobi, Bellerin, these guys who didn't have the greatest of seasons last year, really stepping up. Yeah, I think also Iwobi was terrible last season, probably our worst player, but mm. he's, he's, turn, he's, he's pushing for that first team position. He's got it today. Who knows what happened with Meza Ozil? Because that was a bit of a strange one, not in the squad. Mm. But listen, Awobi might just start starting now again. Mm. What? Mm. <laughs> um, so, listen, he's pushing and everyone's trying to get in this first team now. Rob Holding, he's, he's, mm. he's not put a foot wrong. He's not put a foot wrong. So maybe Socrates like, I've got to work harder now. Because mm. everyone wants to start in the 11th place and then everyone's going to have to work harder and harder and harder. Great. Okay. Let me get a... Uh, Young Fulham fan in. Um, glad that you still got a smile on your face, but it was a bit of a battering for you guys today. Yeah, it was. Um, I think first half we did kind of play pretty well, but I think it all slipped in the second half. How defensive-wise, you know, we're terrible defensively. We've brought in three defense centre backs, sorry, and like they're still not just not performing. Mm. Which I'm pretty. It's going to take a bit of time, isn't it, for them to gel? Mm, it is, yes. But uh, we also. Missed out three key key players, which is Joe Bryan, Fossey Mensah and Tom Kearney. They were all out injured, yeah. which is really bad. And I mean, it was just, today was just shambles. Uh, was you impressed with Arsenal? I was impressed. I was, I was really impressed. Like, um, first half they were doing pretty well, I, I got to say. Second half they came out with a bang. Mm. They came out with a bang. They came out, you know, just, it was like, an amazing team like Barcelona was just right there. Mm. You understand me? And I feel like... But you guys will be all right this season, won't you? Ho hopefully, hopefully. OK, OK. Cheeky sport, Joel's in the Big building, man. Man. Doing, man. Big man, Robbie. What are you saying, you, man? You, you've got to be happy with that today. Listen, gassed, but happy. Listen, did you did you see how close Man United were to squandering that yesterday? <laughs> I, had, I had Dave I had Dave moving mad, bruv. I'll tell you that for <laughs> sure. But I'll tell you what, yeah, man. Proper please, man. Massive, do you know what? Yeah, I'm happy that everybody is on their toes. Welbeck has done well to get into the team, but guess what? He didn't score today. Abamian comes on, scores two goals. You know what I mean? Shout out to my Gabon brother. We say ça, merci. Allo. Okay. And also, second time, and second time as well. If you look, if you look at if you look at Leno, it's not easy to come in and step in for Czech, you know, the way Czech's been playing. But he's come in, he did an excellent job today, especially in the first 10-15 minutes. Great save after about yeah. 10 minutes. We were we were getting we were getting, you know what I mean? They were mm. testing us a little bit, do you know what I mean, in the beginning. But Leno kept his cool, so big, cool, big shout out to him. Mm. And I'll tell you what, I thought Bellerin was strong today, do you know what I mean? Like, especially second half, I really loved, I saw the confidence come up. Massive shout out to Alex, man. Awobi, yeah. Since you come back from the World Cup, I don't know what those Nigerians did to you over there, yeah. But you <laughs> have been on your job. Do you know where I'm coming from? And you've got to give respect to the manager for this, man. Do you know what I mean? He's come over, he's, he's given everyone a clean slate. Even Aaron Ramsey, man, everybody knows that he, there's the contract thing, but he's been able to put that aside, right, and play football. And he's probably has no, he's had no choice, to be honest with you, because at the end of the day, you need to show your worth at the moment because everybody's doing their thing. I, you know me, I like Messi, but I didn't even realise that he wasn't there today. No disrespect, mm. but I didn't really realise. So, you know what I mean? I'm just happy with what's going on. Even when the, even when the, f the fans were chanting, Unai, give us a wave, Unai, Unai, give us a wave, he could hear us, but his whole, his whole thing was, nah, man, stay cool, stay calm. You know what I mean? And if we keep doing that, we're creeping up the table. Tottenham were talking about, oh, goal difference, goal difference. Take that, man. Do you know what I mean? Okay. Don't forget, each and every Friday on Channel 4, it's the Real Football Fan Show at 12 o'clock. It's the best show, best football show on TV. Take my word for it. You can also catch up on all four, but make sure you watch the programme, the Real Football Fan Show.